Had a whole top diamond in the bottom rose gold. Yo. We about to start an epidemic with this one. Today I will be showing you guys how to edit a eboot and what an eboot is is right here on my PSP you see MHU free store and you see right here free store whatever blah 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 the background you see this little icon image I want to show you how to edit that out how to edit and put your own images on there and to do this you will need to download a program that will be provided for you in the link in the description you download that and install it to your computer and once you have that we can continue by the way you also need a um, photo editing software for this tutorial I'll be using GIMP it's free and I'll post a link for that too if you guys are interested in using GIMP as well okay so to start off once you install your um, program PBP Unpacker right here you're gonna need to download some images and I'm gonna use this one as an icon this one as a background image and the reason I chose a city logo is because the the app I will be editing is a city alike application for the PSP. Okay, to edit it, I just I'm going ahead and drag and drop this into um, GIMP, and I'm gonna scale the canvas first because this is a square icon and it will not look good as a rectangle. So the canvas size is hat or the image size, the resolution for. For a PSP icon image is 144 by 80. Just hit resize. Now you see the image is too big to fit in the canvas, so I'm just gonna use my scaling to here tool and scale it. Now get it centered about there. Scale. Mm, a little bit off center. You can make it a little bit bigger, a little bit thinner. Center it centered. Excellent. Now I'm just going to hit file, save as, and save this as icon0.png because this needs PNG format pictures, portable networks graphics. Export, save. And here is a new image. Okay, we're probably going to want to make a new folder here. And we're going to call it extracts. We don't need this right now, but just for later. Now drag and drop the the background picture. Oh, forgot to exit out this session. Don't save. Sorry about that. Okay, drag and drop this into GIMP. And now the canvas size for this. Well, the picture fits perfectly. I want it like that. But the um, resolution or the image size should be 480 by 272 scale okay and exit and we s not save yet okay now I want to add text to this one so um, 24 is good want a different font bold I'm going to type in MHU. MHU. Um, position it just right. Right there. Now I want another font, but the. Make another font right here. Version 1.12. Close image, flatten image, file, 
save as name this one pick one dot png and save it save now exit out of here now here are two edited pictures now the next step it will be plug in your PSP okay so once you plug in your PSP in a USB mode open up the app the homebrew that you want to edit and you will see a file called eboot.psp pvp drag that out and minimize this for now now open up pvp unpacker click open and open the pvp file and then you're going to click extract extract them to the new folder we made extracts okay okay now right here you're gonna want to delete icon 0.png and pick one up png because we're replacing these and go ahead and drag in your new images do not delete these two these are very important do not delete them okay now go ahead and exit out of that open pvp unpacker again and select new and click this box right here where it says param sfo and go into your extracts folder okay we don't have an icon one dot pmf that's a little video we don't have one yet so pick one up png right there data psp so like that icon zero png and pick zero png i'll show you that what that is in a bit okay so that's all we have for now just click save save and we made a new eboot we can go ahead and delete all these things now here's a new eboot okay now we can delete these things as well delete delete shut up all right right click cut now go back in your PSP Right, click paste copy and replace or move and replace whatever and now I'll show you the new eboot on my okay so we're back in my PSP and then you'll see right there that is my new image and I like this better just for the fact that I made it myself and I think it looks pretty nice I could have done a little bit better with the icon but I overall say it's pretty nice my new MHU free store icon. Alright, well thank you for watching my video. Next video we'll show you how to make the icon zero icon one dot PMF file. So please like, comment, and subscribe and that video will come soon. Alright, thank you.